get the money, so I go get it. Hate means I do something right, so I'ma let them. Yeah, I'ma let them. What is going on, guys? We're back after a little couple week break. Down here at school, still getting adjusted to things. It's a lot different than than what Notre Dame was like. A lot more, I guess, like commuting to campus and uh, a lot more people here for sure. But uh, it's been super fun the past couple weeks. We've been getting the work in over at the field. It's been a blast so far, but uh, we're here in the apartment right now, just kind of chilling. We got Boone. Boone is Sam's dog. Yeah, I'll give you guys a little tour of the apartment. So you got my room right here. It's just pretty simple. You got the computer set up over there where I get all the work done. My scooter, that's how I have been commuting to campus. And then uh, the bed. You got a closet right here too. Pretty big closet actually, but you got that over there too with some stuff. Of course, you know, I got to bring the golf clubs. We also got this light right here. Um, which puts that on the ceiling um, So we're not allowed to have LED lights in here because the sticky stuff will chip the walls or whatever and then the bathroom We've got a toilet light, which is pretty cool and then just Basic bathroom. We'll go into The living room area. We've got the TV right there watching a little college football today And we've got all the stuff going on so overall pretty nice, and then we've also got this little guy right here, Boone. He is a beast. Uh, it's, it's really nice to have a dog around, because you know, I got two dogs at home, so it's cool to have this guy around hanging out with us. So we got our gloves in yesterday. I'll give you guys a little showing of what my glove looks like. It's got the, the logo on there, the RK. I went with the basket web. Um, it actually came out really nice, a huge fan of it. Um, black embroidery and black stitching right there, as you can see. Um, Pro Preferred, 11 and 3 quarters, 205 finger shift, closes pretty well. It's pretty tight still. We got the patch right there, and then uh, just be a stud. I really like how it ended up coming out, so it's pretty much the apartment. It's kind of basic. We've also got a little balcony out there that I can show you guys. This is like our little balcony area right here we got. The living situation is obviously much better than, than the dorms. Um, I'm sleeping in my own bed um, that's not in a twin XL, so that's cool. It's pretty much it for the apartment. About to head to the field soon and uh, just just toss a little bit today. I threw my first like official bullpen, I guess you could say, yesterday. so. Just gonna take it super light. I'll take you guys over there, show you the field. You guys can see me throw a little bit and uh, maybe even meet some of the guys who are over there at the field. So they've been itching for me to, to get the camera out. So today is, is gonna be the first day that I kind of bring the camera to the field and stuff. So I'm excited for that. Um, hopefully you guys will enjoy it. And um, yeah, I'm excited for this year though, you know. Um, Still adjusting to the new place, but you know it's 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 really cool to to be here, and I'm super excited for for what's to come in the future here. And um, you know I've I've already been working over the past couple of weeks on some stuff and trying to get better. So it's it's really nice, and I'm I'm excited. All right, y'all, we're at the field, in the locker room right here. We got a good old right next to the door. So. Very similar to last year, but there's a lot more room to work with. I also have a chair. This is the locker room right here. Super nice in here, lots of space, very open. Got places to sit down, so really cool. Um, about to change, head out, and throw. Let's do it. <laughs> Back here in the apartment. Throwing the other day was pretty good. I uh, just got the arm up and moving around because I had thrown a bullpen the day before. It is Monday, so I had class this morning. 
uh, got up, made some breakfast, and went to class. And uh, it's about one o'clock right now. I've got skill work at four and then lift at five. So got some free time right now. I'm gonna make some lunch and then uh, I'm gonna watch a little bit of The Last Dance. So I haven't watched The Last Dance yet which is probably really bad. I had to watch an episode for class. So I watched the one episode and uh, really liked it. So I was like, well, I might as well watch the rest of it since I haven't seen it yet. So I've been kind of watching that a little bit. Just gonna make some lunch and then head over to the field. It's game day here in Columbia. Super excited. Uh, first Gamecock football game. Gonna be cool, night game. Um, there's been a lot of hype going around on social media with like the new lighting and stuff at the stadium. So should be really cool to see that and uh, just be a part of of that today. So super excited. Watching a little football on the television before going out to tailgate with the team today before the game. Notre Dame with a big game today. Always going to be keeping an eye on those guys um, throughout the year. So rooting for them to get an upset of Ohio State today. Be really cool to see, so I'm excited. Uh, it's definitely gonna be a little different than, than Notre Dame. Um, a, lot, a lot more people, I'm assuming, for these games, just because uh, a lot more students here, so. Super excited, and um, yeah, I'll see you guys over at the football stadium tonight. atmosphere as you guys can see compared to Notre Dame pretty well uh, pretty cool just a great experience overall down here in the tunnel um, let's see I got my little little cleat thing right there so I keep my cleats down here I'll walk out right in there to the field I gotta put my cleats on and stuff so There it is. You got some of the fellas thrown out there. It's a hot day today here in Carolina. Just, just a beautiful scenery down here in, in Founders. Gonna get some light throwing in today. Took yesterday off because I had a bullpen on Friday. But gonna get the work in, enjoy the rest of the day. As you could see, throwing went pretty well yesterday. Just went out there through light and uh, got my work in. Have been working on some new things over the course of the past couple weeks since I've been down here. So 
I've been really working on keeping my backside um, tall on the way through balance because um, I've I've tended to kind of get into my backside a little too early, which causes my command to be a little bit more all over the place. Um, and when my command is really good and when I'm pounding the zone is when my backside is, is staying tall and driving down towards home plate using the slope of the mound compared to trying to get into my back leg too quick. I've also been working on a new pitch um, over the, the past, I mean, couple days. I just started working on it like four or five days ago. So um, it's like a spike curve. So basically what we've kind of decided is that like slider now is more of like a cutter and my curveball now is more of like a power slurve. So we've just kind of taken both of those and still are going to use them, but they're just going to be classified as being like different, I guess. Whereas now the spike curve is more 12-6 and it has more vertical action compared to my old curveball. Um, and it's weird because my old curveball used to be a lot more 12-6 than, than what it is now. And I think that's just because my arm speed has just gotten much faster than what it was when I was like 15, 16 years old. So I feel like that might be why I haven't been getting as many swing and misses on it as I usually have um, over the past about year, year and a half is because it's not spinning the same as my fastball does. So we've been working on those two things over the past couple of weeks. And um, you can kind of see me in some of the um, videos of me throwing from yesterday. Uh, I'm editing it right now, but as y'all can see, I, I'm kind of working on holding my, my balance and, and working towards my target instead of trying to work down first. Um, then you can also see me kind of spin some. You can see the difference between the two, um, the slurve and the 12.6, and I'll, I'll put the, the overlay up on the screen right now so you guys can kind of tell the difference, but there's definitely a lot more vertical movement on the spike curve than what there is on the, the slurve. So yeah, but that's been the past couple weeks here. The football game this past weekend was absolutely amazing. And um, I'm looking forward to Georgia here in a couple weeks here at home. It's gonna be absolutely insane. So super excited for that. But if you want me to go a little bit more in depth um, on kind of my mechanics, that I've been working on over the past couple weeks along with like some pitch design stuff that I've been working on. Um, let me know, leave a like down below. I'm gonna say, let's say if this gets 500 likes, I'll make a video based upon that whole concept that I've been working on. Um, and I'll show you guys some before and afters over the past couple years, so. Yeah, but be sure if you are new to the channel to hit that subscribe button. Also, if you haven't already, give this video a thumbs up. And also, if you want to see that video come out here anytime soon, give that video a thumbs up. Like I said, 500 likes, and I'll make a video um, kind of explaining a little bit more about that stuff. So, super excited to be getting content out to you guys. I'm having an absolute blast here in Columbia so far. And um, But yeah, that's going to be it for this one, y'all. Hopefully, y'all did enjoy, and I'll see y'all next Monday. Peace out.